Standing here with the owner of Trackhouse Racing, Justin Marks. Heck of a win for you guys. I know every win is hard to come by, but it's your home racetrack. Nashville means a lot. So what does this night mean for you as a team owner? I mean, I, I think this is this is one of our biggest wins. I mean, if not the biggest win. I mean, you know, we, we built this company in Nashville. We run this company in Nashville. We've got great partners like Tootsies and, and um, you know, this is, this is, uh, it's just really, really special. And I, I just told Ty not that long ago, I was like, man, if we could draw it up on the board three years ago, it's like we're, that we're going to win in Nashville and we're going to have these Nashville sponsors and all that stuff here. Uh, I don't know if I would have believed it, but, um, you know, we've got an amazing group of people. And Worldwide Express, what a weekend for Worldwide Express. I mean, winning in the truck race, pulling the cup race, winning the cup race. Um, it's just, it's a little bit hard for me to find the words right now. I just, I just know there's going to be a party at Tootsie's in about an hour from now. Um, but it's... Um, it's just, it's really meaningful. We had a great year last year. We had a really, really great year last year, and, and it's been an up and down year this year, and sophomore years are always difficult. Uh, and so and so to be able to come out and qualify on the pole, lead the laps that we did today, and finish the job in the dominating fashion that Ross and this one team did, is um, it's an amazing moment for our company, and I'm just, I'm totally living the dream. It's just, it's, a, it's a, an amazing moment for us. I know how you are as a person. I, I'm friends with you personally, and I, I see how you operate with Trackhouse and the people there. You want the best for the people, and I know that there was a lot of chatter about this conversation that you had with Ross about, hey, pick a different racing style, race people clean, but the move of the race was your driver going three wide, which really kind of led to the win here and standing in victory lane. So what did you think of the move? Because it looks pretty good racing to me. It's amazing racing. I mean, he's an amazing race car driver. And, and, you know, I said it earlier today, I think that there's there's a narrative that sort of took on a life of its own about me sitting Ross down and telling him, hey, hey this is how it's going to be. It, it, it didn't really happen that way. I mean, it's this this is two young people finding our way in the top in the top form of this sport. And and we had conversations not as a boss and an employee, but as friends and as 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 um, as racers. And, uh, you know, we just worked through that conversation together. It's like, you know, how can we we have such an opportunity here. We've got fast race cars. You've got so much talent. We have so much great people, so many great people at Trackhouse doing great work. How can we make sure that we maximize that opportunity? And, you know, I don't, the last couple of weeks, we've had fast race cars. We just haven't had good races, but tonight we had a good race and, and we were able to close the deal. So I just don't think that much has changed. You know, he, that three wide, you know, those three laps, three wide. I mean, that was, that was great for the sport. It's great for the fans. It's great for everybody. Uh, it's awesome watching. Um, but I'm just, you know, I'm getting more comfortable. He's getting more comfortable. I think we have an incredibly bright future together. Um, we have a lot more of these moments coming. So I'm just super pumped for him. Last but not least, you're a great ambassador for the sport. I've seen you racing all over the country for the last couple of months. But you're going to take your talent to the streets of Chicago. You're going to hop in an Xfinity Series car for college racing. Our, our, We'll party. We'll celebrate tonight. But how much forward are you looking for to Chicago? Yeah, it's uh, look. I I, um, I I was fairly committed to my retirement from NASCAR. But when NASCAR says, "Hey, we're gonna we're gonna go street racing," yeah. I mean, it's like my favorite kind of racing that there is. And so I just sort of lightly socialized that it would be fun to do that. It's all about jockey. I mean, jockey heard that and they're like, "Hey, if you want to go, you know, do that race, then we'll help you do that race." And and um, Obviously, the 10 car at Colleg Racing, um, that's the hottest seat on the road courses, so I've got some pressure ahead of me, but but, um, but I've been racing lately, and I'm excited about it. Um, I'm going to have a lot of fun. Uh, we're going to go try to win that race and hopefully be able to use that experience on Saturday and help uh, Daniel and Ross and also Shane in the 91 car on Sunday, so it's going to be a really, really fun weekend. Congratulations. Go celebrate. We'll see you in Chicago. Thank you.